But I've always felt weird in here. It's too clean. And Ms. Holcomb as well. How rare to see you out. And with a complete stranger. Curious. Just tagging along, Vicar DeSoto. Don't mind me. I so rarely get new people to talk to. Name your poison, anything at all. Spiritual counseling, this season's toss ball predictions, the quickest way out of town. But what? I thought you would talk to him. You wanted to speak to me, Ms. Holcomb? Every time I've tried to engage you in conversation, you look at the floor, answer in single words, and slink away. I can't imagine what would be so grave as to drive her to my mission. What has Mr. Thompson asked you to do? That seems well within your expertise. The way we do it's by cutting off power to the others. The ones who left. Adelaide McDevitt's encampment. I can see why that troubles you. Miss Holcomb has a soft heart. Always has, if you believe the talk. Assuming your goal is to save as many as possible, then you should bring everyone together. Send the power to Edgewater and convince the deserters to return to the fold. Not if things are left to stand as they are. If you don't mind a bit of unsolicited advice, be cautious on your way to the geothermal plant. It is not as safe as you might assume. One of the reasons I transferred here was to fulfill my duty in hunting down banned heretical texts. I happen to know such a book is, as we speak, tainting a collector's library in Emerald Vale. However, the collector's residence lies outside the town's walls. My retrieval efforts have been thwarted by marauders who have overrun the property. Should you fare better than me, I'd pay a handsome sum for the book. It's a handwritten journal, a faded blue cover with the name M. Bakonu handwritten in the lower corner. I'll mark where I saw it on your map. Assuming you're serious? Thank you. If you retrieve it, you can always find me here. Any progress on that matter we discussed? Please get it. A religious text deemed heretical by the OSI is an unsafe object at large, though I understand why a collector would desire to possess such a rare book. Because I'm also a collector of books. Rare things in this colony. Appreciation of the written word outside monthly periodicals is virtually unknown here. I've never seen you before, and there's been no paperwork indicating a transfer. Half the time it's wrong, but... A new worker without paperwork? Unheard of. Also, you lack the distinctive worker gaze. Usually either a deadening behind the eyes, or in some rare cases, a wild-eyed frenzy, like a trapped animal. Pretty universal here. Except for Ms. Holcomb, who, for some reason, doesn't seem to have much to say to me. Isn't that right? It's just... there's more to it all than numbers. Sorry. Oh, nothing could be further from the truth. I'm simply bemoaning the level of spiritual awareness in this town. Yes, but there are few who hear me in this miserable place. I must double my efforts to elevate my flock. These are good, hard-working people here. Yes, and thank you for pointing it out. It is wrong of me to succumb to distress. This place could be so much more, and I will continue in my quest to make it so. They who are not satisfied with their work are satisfied with nothing. No? How about, um, work fortifies the spirit. True exhaustion awaits idle hands. 
The OSI teaches that the Grand Architect set a perfect system in motion at the beginning of time. Contentment is found by accepting one's role in that grand plan. The Order of Scientific Inquiry, also known as scientism to the layperson. You don't talk to the Grand Architect. Once the universe was set in motion, it stepped back. It has no concern for us. We will eventually decode the plan and all its intricacies. Once we are able to deduce the properties of every particle in the universe and its trajectory, we will know everything. The future, the past, each person's place within the plan, all will be laid out before us, removing struggle and bringing peace. No one will ever need question their path again. Some even believe this ultimate knowledge will unlock mankind's true potential, and we will all become akin to grand architects ourselves, after a fashion. I would love to discuss the finer points of my religion with you. Oh wait, no I wouldn't. Seriously though, to truly understand the metaphysics involved takes years of study and contemplation. I used to skip rocks in the river till Constable Reyes ticketed me for unlicensed terraforming. I think she was jealous. She don't know how to skip rocks her own self. Clever.
Yeah, huh? You mean about the mission being too clean? I know, but... Vicar says the universe is a machine, that it runs by law. Real machines have gunked up oil, scratches, and worn bits. You can tell they've seen handling, been used by folk. The machine Vicar sees is one ain't never been run. It's not for people to live in. It's something on a museum shelf. Under glass. Fixing the universe is a job for somebody way better than the likes of me. Move along, stranger. We don't want any trouble. I don't know you. Whatever you're looking for, it ain't here. Move along. Armed strangers wandering into my camp for one. Some of my camp wandering out for another. Answers, huh? You must be one of those philosophicals. Already got ourselves one of those. Yeah, that's us. And you can tell Thompson we're doing just fine by ourselves. If you're gonna start wandering around my camp, know that I got my sights on you. Over in the hothouse, tending crop. Enough with the questions. No offense, but I've got a lot on my mind. Explains why you're still yammering on at me. No, I'm sorry. 
That was unworthy of me. Lady named Zoe went missing some nights ago. Just up and vanished without a trace. Now I'm pacing around wondering if Marauders got to her. It's not like Zoe to go wandering. Figured she might be out scavenging, but that ain't exactly her talent. Can't imagine where she's gone. Vale's a wide place. She could be anywhere. Could do without the gallows humor. I'll tell you what I can. Vex me. If she told anybody, they ain't telling me. I'd check her room, but I got yelled at for snooping once already. Little ways ago. She was always obsessing over her serial dramas. Wanted to see what the fuss was about. Could be. Dangers are plenty out there. No telling why marauders would steal somebody like Zoe. Got no useful skills, far as I could tell. Marauder gang just moved into the districts a little ways east. Their numbers are growing. Gotta come from somewhere. Well, enough to know we never got on. Zoe and Stefan were close. If anybody knows the workings of her mind, he does. She was lazy and thoughtless, but she's still one of our own. What is it? <laughs> 